So Gethsemane released a few days ago and oh boy was I not ready for this collection because in hindsight I think I missed out on a lot of stuff that might not be released ever again. So for Gethsemane I was pretty hyped up because I saw all the pictures online especially on Christian Cock official his Instagram page. All the little teaser and snippets reminded me of a certain thing and that is actually my other hobby. I collect action figures as well and the feeling that I get when I see a good deal or a really nice release of something that I was anticipating. Rick Owens did a similar thing and he released furry cargo baskets, furry Ramones. And if you see the designs, they even released like a Grinch version of Geo baskets where they all, all this, all the black basically, was green hair. I wouldn't personally wear it as fast as I would like the Arizona Birkenstocks but on the other hand it's really cool to have something like that and if you look on Instagram and you look for Gethsemane you see some Instagram pictures of people actually having them in hand and they look really really good. So I am expecting, um, I'm looking forward actually to cargo baskets in the fur and I want to know what they look like in person because on the styling pictures on the Rick Owens website they look fantastic but more as a collector's item just as the big rocks of the Rick Owens Montclair collection. So with the collection actually came one big question for myself and that is are we going to keep purchasing the same models over and over and over again just with an upgrade? And this is what's been going on for a long time because first about Ramones and I thought this was the ultimate shoe or sneaker and then a abstract version releases or a double bumper version and a silver color 18 ounce denim version like this one. And then you have the abstract ones, the low tops, high tops, hairy versions, the toe is covered up in that nylon, all these different materials. Is it really necessary? No. Is it cool? Yes. I love it. It's basically collecting at this point. I would love to have a pair of cargo baskets with the black fur on my closet just showing it and wearing the other pairs that I have of my Rick Owen sneakers. So what I've been seeing a lot is, I think it's not everything that's uploaded right now on the uh, Rick Owens page. And on Farfetch, I think everything went pretty quick, even the low furry Ramones, the high furry Ramones, all went. And the green Geo baskets as well, there was only one size left when I looked, probably gone now. Cargo baskets obliterated in one single day, as usual, except for the black regular version of cargo baskets. So. Do you guys get this collector's feel as well with Rick Owens and the Gethsemane collection? Because right now I start to feel like these are just gold versions of regular releases uh, that you would usually buy and wear. So I'm pretty curious to see people styling with the furry shoes, furry sneakers. And I love the other Gethsemane stuff that's coming up. So the big blankets, which look, just looks like a two by two meters big blanket. It looks awesome. It looks like Darth Vader, Voldemort in my opinion, it's I think around 2000 euros for one single blanket coat. It looks really cool but practically it would never be there for me. So I will add these to my list, the cargo baskets in fur, but for collecting purposes I think. Because I don't see myself wearing them in my style, maybe sometimes for an event, but other than that they will just end up in the closet. But with a collector's smile on my face.